So it's Monday morning, here I am at the Dead Dolls House. So I'm doing my personal branding uh, program for women in cybersecurity and it just looks so lovely. So it's, we have a small group um, in person today and yeah, it is so hot outside. It's absolutely cooking already. I think it's gonna be about 29 degrees here, but it's, I'm really excited to do this. I love doing all of this. So um, the, my, my, um, I want to call them my, my ladies, my women, my um, delegates, my attendees of the course are, will be arriving soon and then we're going to get cracking. We have such a lot to cover and I just can't wait to help them raise their visibility and raise their voices. So I'll catch up with you soon. Hey Jane, so here I am at uh, the station. It's been a bit of a heck of a morning again and um, set off about two hours um, in advance to go and see a CISO in London because that's how long it takes me. So. It's what it is, and um, my tire pressure was really low, which meant that I had a puncture. So I drove up to the nearest um, garage, um, it's booked in, I've got a hire car, I've driven to another station and I can get to my meeting. Funny enough, just in time, because I'm going to a different station. So it's all fun and games, but it's a busy week this week, obviously, because we've got the insecurity event. So we're doing the codes of conduct, conduct, and I've been running two personal branding classes, one for women and one that is mixed, a mixed group. So we've had um, CISOs in, in it, um, some heads of, um, some aspiring CISOs, and we've also had some entrepreneurs as well as some salespeople. So it's been really, really interesting. And the one that I did yesterday actually was just for women. And yeah, it was kind of, just more more stories more um, empowerment you know certainly within the group more um, strong bonds being made which really is what we need you know I keep talking about how you know being more kind in this industry showing kindness not just to women with women but actually just in in general you know we need to support one another collaborate more um, and go off and do the job that we're meant to do which is to protect businesses and countries um, and people so that's who we need to be combating or fighting and uh, protecting and mitigating risk. So yeah, really, really good event. Um, they're different every single time that I run them, which is really interesting. Um, it also means that whilst there's a framework for them and a set formula, that it does change because it, you know, it's very fluid, you know, depending on what com comes up. So I will catch up with you later in the week. Bye. Hey, it's Jane. Um, just doing a live video actually in preparation for the insecurity uh, event it's the next one it's the code of conducts um, that we're going to be discussing so the aim of the game is to have a meaningful conversation about what's going on at security events um, so that people particularly women are safe to attend and they're not harassed and also so that event organizers have got something to actually go by so we're looking at having a meaningful discussion around this we're looking at actually designing and creating a code of conduct for events so if an event organizer doesn't have one they can actually use the insecurity code of conduct event um, kind of guide and so we'll be looking at how to manage it and, and uh, enforce it, you know, what to say if you go to an event and you witness something that doesn't meet with the code of conduct standard. Um, so how, how do you deal with it? You know, do you approach the organizer? Do you tweet it like I did at InfoSec? Um, how do you handle it? Um, and so we are, we're gonna be doing all of that and uh, looking to create something that we can actually um, allow others to use and then after that once you've actually got something meaningful then we will then suddenly the insecurity movement uh, which I'm heading up will go out and speak to CISOs and get sign off and vendors major vendors and also um, event organizers so that is the aim of the game and it may change when we all get together to discuss this we are streaming it live so this is one of the reasons why I'm testing this out just to make sure that it works and uh, yeah and the other really good news is that IC Squared have um, or are sponsoring it so that is Dashini who's the new managing director of the UK and EMEA um, so she um, has come through such a trooper and then also the cybersecurity challenge they're also going to be there and they're in support so it's all going to be good stuff I'm really happy about this so I'll catch you in just over a day speak to you soon bye Oh, you video me. Why are you, why are you covered in 
Hi, Saul. <laughs> The idea is that you don't stay there. Okay. All right, you should be able to hear me now. All right, try that. So it's the two birthdays, not the same day. 